Conducting a reef survey is easy. All you need is a slate and pencil to record your sightings during your dive, a survey scan form that is available free from reef headquarters, and a good reference book to look up mystery fish. During your dive, record all the fish species that you encounter. It's very important to only record those that you can positively identify. You don't actually have to count each fish. Rather, at the end of your dive, assign each species one of four abundance categories. Single, if you just saw one. Few, if you saw two to 10 individuals. Many, if you saw 11 to 100. And abundant, if you saw more than 100. In all of Reef's project regions, please also record the presence of sea turtles during your dive. If you are diving the Pacific Northwest, Oregon, Washington, or British Columbia, you can also record the presence of certain invertebrates as part of the Living Reef program, using the same method as for fish. See Reef's website for a complete list of species that are included in this invertebrate program. If you see a species that doesn't belong, such as these non-native lionfish found off the coast of North Carolina, Please report those too. After your dive is over, transfer your data to a reef scan sheet and return your data to reef headquarters in Key Largo, Florida. Remember, you can conduct reef surveys anytime and anywhere within our project region, which is currently all of North and Central America, the Caribbean, the Galapagos Islands, and Hawaii. Surveys can be done on snorkel or on scuba. And surveys conducted as part of Reef's great annual fish count in July are done with the same method and materials as surveys conducted at other times of the year. So get out there and make a dive that counts.